Hey, it's me, Cynthia. I am she, and we are out at our land, and it's very, very windy. I'm in the the RV. We have a fan on, and the fan seems to just be sucking up dirt. I think I'm gonna turn the fan off and I don't have anything I'm not tall enough to reach that only Marcus oh I have a pen I do have a pen and nope I'm still too short okay well it's hot as you can see uh, we just went on a ride on the wildcat and uh, I forgot that that terrifies me because Mark does like he pushes it to the limit and we're not experienced drivers out here and uh, there's a lot of slipping and sliding going on and he likes to do hair tur hairpin turns and it's terrifying and we don't there are no people out here there's nobody to help us if we if we flip so I wanted to out and he pitched a fit because I wanted to come back to the RV he said I wish you didn't even come out here today so I flipped him off. Yeah. And I said, I will never come out here again with you then. Uh, so. Oh, there's a giant hawk. Can you see that? He's giant. I'm, I'm hoping you can see him. Oh. Where did he go? Oh, he's so close. What is he doing? Oh my gosh. What is he doing? Oh. Wow. You guys, he is like, his wingspan is like the length of me. He's giant. Giant. Oh my gosh. If I go outside, he'll carry me away. And I'm afraid of heights. He is beautiful. I hope he comes back. Maybe he'll catch that rat down there. Um, see that hole? And then see that hole? Um, there's a rat. Well, you can't. No, those are different holes. There's the hole. Right there. Um, there's a white rat that lives in there. Uh, we saw that today, and um, boy am I horrified. And he ran under our trailer, so he's in here somewhere, or under me somewhere. <laughs> and uh, he's long, skinny, and white. He's a desert rat. And um, I guess technically we're in his house, so I'm not gonna hunt him down and kill him. They're cute. They're creepy. Creepy I don't mean like scary. I mean creepy as in I wouldn't buy one from the store. But my sister would. My sister had rats. On purpose. Strange. Um, I think Mark is back. Oh yeah. I see sand. Here he comes up the trail, or he's just kicking up sand. Well, I guess he drove back down the street. Ugh. All right, well, I have my crochet. Is that a turtle? No. And uh, I'm gonna. I'm making a scrap blanket, probably for dogs. Um, yeah, I have that lady, that lady that passed away. I have a bunch of scrap. She has like a bazillion. There's like a hundred different color balls. But I just grabbed these because uh, I had my dogs. What's he doing? Okay. 
He keeps doing that. Driving up and down the street. It just irritates me. He's driving into people's yards. Because nobody lives down here yet. But everybody has started something. So he's driving up people's yards to see what they've started. Building and stuff. Alright. I'm gonna go. Bye. I love this place. Yeah, so I have all of those balls. Oh, we have uh, tickets. Oh, 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 whoo! Oh, that scared me. Okay, we have our Powerball tickets. Ah, so we have a scratch off and, and the regular ones. So this is for the week. No, this is for the... June 10th, 2016, 2017. Um, what drawing? $20 for one draw for, oh, for tonight. Power play, no. I don't know what any of that means. Okay. So, is he coming back now? Not me. There he goes again. I really don't understand the purpose. Like when when we get a second one of those or he gets a dirt bike, then that'll be fine. I can drive one and I can drive at my own speed. We'll just select a trail, a numbered trail, and we'll just keep to it. And I can drive at my own speed. But driving with him, he's driving like 50, 60 miles per hour and we don't know the trails and he's just going as fast as he can. And that is terrifying. Um, something just scratched. What just scratched? Please don't tell me. Ugh, I'm really creeped out. Okay, I, I want to go home. I want to go home. I don't want to sleep with rats. Well, that's today, so I'll talk to you on another day. Bye.